How many times have you said these words? I'm going to start working out. And you truly start, but two to three weeks down the line, your workout plan just starts fading out until you don't even give the muscle anymore. Literally. The added things to stick to are your new year resolution and your workout schedule. On the spots, they are exciting and you look forward to sticking with them. But before you know it, life or work happens and you just have to set it back into your old routine. But of course, there have been notable success stories about people who despite the odds and a busy work schedule have been able to dedicate themselves to constant exercise and workout. Well, it's not as simple as ABC, but it could be. And the following steps are how. You know, Yoda said it best, do or do not, there is no try. Don't straddle the line between wanting to get fit and actually doing something about it. Take the first step towards LDL habits and commit to a 30-day fitness challenge. Go for a walk or run on Monday, Wednesday and Fridays. Then perform a circuit of at least 5 bodyweight exercises on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Keep it up for a month to make the exercise habit really stick. Have you ever seen a blockbuster movie produced without a production plan or guideline? No. Likewise, it is art if not impossible to keep to a workout plan without an actual plan or visible well laid out schedule. So this will help you to understand A, why you're working out, whether to keep fit or shed weight, and B, how to make it happen. Keep your plan as uncomplicated and understandable as possible, ensuring that it aligns with your normal work schedule. You're not going to scheme off 30 pounds in a week, that's for sure. So aim for something that's realistic as a first step. For instance, increase your workout schedule from two to three days a week, or exercise for 15 more minutes each time. And try as much as possible to stay away from exercises that are too rigorous for you. You don't want to start with a workout routine that will wear you out eventually. The mistake most people make is believing that working out requires you to stay away from food. No, it doesn't. On the contrary, it requires you to eat quality food and balanced meals. Emphasis on quality. If you're a fan of junks, this is a free advice. Stay away from them, or else your countless hours of exercise and eating the gym only a month into fetching water into a basket is futile. Some people often place too much emphasis on food while neglecting other needs, like proper hydration. Your body is made up of 70% of water, which means that water plays a key role in your everyday function and peak performance. Staying hydrated is critical for performing at the intensity needed or necessary to build a lean muscle. Drink and sip water throughout the day during fat loss and muscle building exercises. It is possible for you to also confuse hunger with insufficient hydration, and so it's especially critical to stay well hydrated when cutting fat. This sounds obvious, but it's probably the number one reason you don't stick with your gym routine. When you pick something you hate doing, maybe you read about how great CrossFit is for getting into shape, or perhaps you were impressed with the idea of putting on 30 pounds of muscle by lifting heavy this year. Still, the best exercise routine isn't going to do any good if it doesn't inspire you to stick to it. Going to the gym doesn't have to be a case of take your medicine. There is no reason why you shouldn't enjoy or look forward to going to the gym to exercise. So whether it's jogging, racquetball, craft magal, hiking, baseball, or even lifting weights, find an activity that you actually like. Now do different types of workouts to keep things interesting and to exercise different muscle groups. If the weight bench is usually your thing, hop on the stair climber for some cardio instead. Also, switch between machines and free weights when you're strength training. You don't have to reinvent your entire routine every week, but you do want to shift things around a little. If we'll be honest with ourselves, one of the things that inspires us to even start working out in the first place, besides the snide comments from your friends and family about the extra weight you've been putting on, is probably the before and after gym photos of someone who has lost 30 to 40 or even 80 pounds by sticking to a workout regimen. Besides it being a way of tracking the physical progress you've made, it can also motivate others to take the first step towards a better health and fitness lifestyle. The important thing to keep in mind is consistency. Make your schedule into a routine and your routine into a habit. Now make sure you keep to the lines as much as possible. The truth is, the first 30 to 40 days might be the hardest, but once you get over the boulder, then you're set for a straight home run. Remember, discipline, consistency and determination. And who knows, you might be sharing the next before and after photo that will inspire someone else to do it too.